In this video, I'll show you how to delete all your WooCommerce products using two different methods. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so before we actually do anything, the first thing you want to do is just make sure you back up your website, right? So whether that's with a WordPress plugin or free hosting provider. With that being said, let's head over to all products and we'll start with the first method. So we can use the default WordPress system. So we can click on the screen here and then we can change the number of pages. So when we go to bulk delete um, the items, so we can bulk select it here and then we can just select move to trash and that will delete 200 at a time or whatever the number is you've set um, here, okay? Okay, so that's deleted fine. However, it did take quite a while to bulk delete it. Okay, so we'll move on to the second method, which will just delete it directly from our database, okay? So let's head over to our hosting provider. So I'm going to navigate over to PHP My Admin. Okay, so I'm going to click on PHP My Admin here. Okay, and then I'm going to go ahead and select this particular database here. If you're not too sure what is your database name, we can navigate over to um, File Manager and then you'll find your website folder. Okay, and then if you click on wpconfig.php. Okay, so here where it says db underscore name, it will tell you your database name here. So when we're in PHP my admin, we just want to make sure that this matches. Okay. And it's especially true when you've got multiple different sites running on your hosting. Okay. So we need to find where it says post here and my table structure is actually WP F2 underscore post. But here it's saying staging because I've actually got a staging version of my particular website. So I just need to ignore all of these. Okay. And then we'll click on this option here. Okay, so now we'll click on SQL. Okay, and then we'll paste in our code that we need to actually delete all the products from our website. Okay, so I've pasted a code here. There's a few things to note. So my database table structure is actually different from this code here. So this code is referencing WP underscore and then the rest of the table name. Whereas my table structure is actually WPF2, okay? So wherever it mentions WP underscore, I need to update this to match my actual table name, okay? So for example, here where it says from WP underscore term, we need to replace that, replace it here. Okay, so I think I've changed all reference of WP underscore, okay, to match our table structure. So let's click go. Okay. And that's run successfully. So let's head back over to our dashboard and see if we've got any products remaining. So let's refresh this page. Okay. And all our products have been deleted. So as you can see, this is by far one of the quickest methods to bulk delete your products all at once. If you enjoyed this video, like, and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave it in the comment box below.